When you think of cutting edge scientific research, you might not think of Fort Lewis College, but attending the college's undergraduate research symposium just might change that. Uh, I studied the uh, correlation between periodontitis and diabetes. So I basically took this bacteria called Aggregatobacter actinomycetin comitans and used the bacteria, exposed it to some cells, and tested the cellular response. Kristen's research is just one of 50 student projects that were on display at the 8th Annual Research Symposium. The symposium is an opportunity for FLC students to follow their interests and work on research that just might help change the world. The biology department has ongoing studies that involve diabetes, so there's lots of information about diabetes that we already learned, and I just took it and applied it because the two diseases, periodontitis and diabetes, are both systemic diseases that are intercorrelated and relate to each other in the body. The people who benefit perhaps most of all are the students themselves. This experience is invaluable preparation as they go on to graduate school and, as Dean Maureen Brandon explains, start a career. But I would say um, in many, many work situations, they'll be expected to do this sort of thing also. Um, if you're working for the state or uh, federal um, land management agencies, I mean, they all do these kinds of um, data collections, presentations, public presentations, you still have to be able to um, explain your results to somebody else. It's so cool to see how proud the parents are. Parents and siblings and family members and other people who have mentored these students along the way, they come and either listen to their oral presentations or they come and talk to them here in the poster session. And it's so cool to see how proud they are of these, of these students.